What's up everybody? It's Milbro here. I'm back with the Richard Die episode 11 now and I've spent the overnight crafting some duct tape and uh, just doing general things. I did get the other... I got the other fertilizer crafted and I have the hops planted. I did plant some some coffee as well so got some more stuff growing we might be able to harvest the uh the old uh cotton here and pretty soon along with goldenrod and so have our first full harvest of goldenrod pretty soon but i'm just getting ready to make a trader trip so i'm just gonna continue organizing my stuff and i will be back with you guys uh once i'm close to the trader and i'm also oh and almost forgot here but uh I'm also at uh, 10,668 dukes. But anyways, meet you at the trader. Coming up on the trader now, trader bobs, you have the usual uh, close this door before uh, Curly gets in. As you can see, I'm rolling with a crossbow now, as, and it's really nice not having to draw every shot after reloading. Uh, bow's good early game, but it's not that great. God, how are you doing, Trader Bob? Be one of the dead. Before I forget, let's, um... I want to just craft this up into the leather. Oh, not only gives me my... Need assistance. My, uh, leather working XP, but also allows me to refine it just a little bit into extra cash, and... Just go to and sell this paper off for some XP. I'm nowhere near making shotgun shells, uh, yeah, because my gunsmithing's not high enough. We'll just toss that out. And we'll just sell off the mini bike wheels. I still have a good uh, set of mini bike wheels uh, at home, but it's. Uh, since I got myself the, uh, the mini bike hood book yesterday, if you haven't seen that episode, I encourage you to do to see, uh, take a look at the. The series uh, in general. Sell off this duct tape, but uh, got got out of an airdrop. Uh, very fortunate little drop. I figured, well, since I have a good set of mini bike wheels, I might as well just uh, save that uh, for the mini bike. And I cooked up a mini bike frame. And I figured since I'm making uh, everything's sold off now, but up to fourteen thousand dukes. Uh, I figured since I started to make fertilizer now, I should at least uh, start collecting nitrate powder, and I knew I at least ran into one. Let's see here. Herbal antibiotics. Um, that's a that's a fairly rare book. As far as I'm aware, you can only find that at uh, you only find that at the the uh, a certain chest in Navis game. Question is, do I really want it for its? Nah, I don't really want it. It's kind of a waste of money because uh, with the the workbench, I can just make a no. The chemistry station, I can just make a a little bit of uh, for the price of moldy bread and some nitrate powder for all that. I can just. Yo, know, I could just make it myself, uh, make, make regular antibiotics. Looks like got Mikey Boy here. How are you, big guy? Wanted to come say hello, huh? Come here. There you go, take your nap. Anyways, uh... I'm going to go and head back to town, and, uh... I have... N and I've got to gather some mechanical parts. I know a good place, uh, which is the Shamway Foods, because I got plenty of shopping carts. So, once I get back to sh get to Shamway, I will let you know once I am there. And I'm going up to Shamway now. So, wanted to say a couple things here. Uh, you know, especially if you watch the channel regularly with me and uh and uh if you've been keeping up with me uh, you will know like uh that a couple days ago I I ended off the channel master series and 
And the same time that that post, uh, that video went up, I made a community poll asking you guys for uh, making, you know, like, because I like to have two series running at the channel at once, and uh, I have a, uh, and I was asking, like, you know, what would you guys want me to do? Ooh, playing leather working. Uh, but, and so, you know, the options were between having a, doing another challenge run, a, a, uh, you know, and then doing a regular playthrough just to fine-tune my skills a little bit, and, uh, and then also, the, uh, the last option was to have a, have a co-op series, and although three of you voted, it's like, uh, I will take, uh, the, uh, vote, I do take the votes into creation, even though it's a very small sample size, uh, I am going to do the, all the votes were for, were in favor of a, of a co-op series, so, hopefully tomorrow, maybe, uh, maybe on Friday, this video is being recorded on a uh, being recorded on Wednesday, and we'll be going up at midnight on Thursday. So hopefully, uh, should have on Friday the well tomorrow or Friday like have the first series of uh, of a co-op series going up. So I wanted to let you guys know that. And also, um, if you're, if you're listening to, uh, well, if you're still here, I appreciate you a lot, and, and, uh, I don't want to convert that just yet, uh, but, I need to scavenge up some mechanical parts and everything, but, uh, you know, I've been kind of trying to bounce some ideas in my head, and, uh, you know, it's like, Figured you know, like let let you guys know some things like you know I've been bouncing around in my head like uh, one little idea for a series I was wanting to do is um, to do um, okay hang on let me put these into a box or or cooler that works too throw those in I can pick them up later. Is like you know, not really a series, but like you know, fun little videos would be to do, uh, um, you know, like little build videos, like kind of doing just fun little builds of uh, stuff and everything like that. And I was like, eh, I don't know if uh, you know, console will, few people would uh, like to see that, you know. Because it's like, for me personally, I'm like, you know, I really like building in this game when I get the chance to, so it's like, I really want to build, uh, but uh, at the same time, I do want to, uh, I do want to kind of keep it, uh, I was like, I would want to wait for uh, the new console version, which is uh, 7... Seven Days of Die Apocalypse, you know, to come out, because it's like... And this is no offense to this version of the game. I absolutely adore this version of the game. It's very fun to play. But it's like, uh, I'm just kind of like... Especially in survival, it's like, I'd basically be forced to, uh... To play in a, uh, a world with cheats, uh... To even get access to all the... Features and everything like that, you know, well, all the block shapes and... And it's like, don't even have painting available on this version, and, uh... It's like, I know some people don't like, uh... Like, when there's a cheat, when people are using cheats, it's like, uh... It's just kind of like looking at, like, you know, the PC version, and, you know, like, upcoming Apocalypse Edition, you know... They're supposed to have, uh, well, it's like, it's gotta have the... The whole shape menu... Everything like that. Ooh, another 20 bucks. Very nice. But, uh... 
It's just kind of like you have all these versions, like, you know, you have all these shapes. I'm like, as much as I would love to do, like, you know, kind of like fun little themed builds on, uh, on this version, it's like, I'm like, the shapes are so limited, especially in survival. I'm, I'm not saying I couldn't come up with some kind of like fun little base build or just like, you know, just some like fun little, I guess you could say, POIs on this version. That's just kind of like, you know, I was, I'd have to cheat all in. Ooh, nice little level up to, uh, on construction tools. But, uh, I'm like, you know, if you want to see me do some, like, you kind of like fun, just dedicated build to the videos, like where I, you know, maybe I use a uh, creative uh, to my, to my full potential, you know, get, be able to do that stuff, and, you know, do let me know in the comments down below if you want to, or, if it, you know, let me know if you want me to save it for for the new console version coming up. That way I have access to more shapes and everything. It's like, uh, it's something I'm definitely considering. And, uh, that's really the big thing I want to talk about in this uh, video. It's like, I've been wrenching the mechanical UV shopping carts down for mechanical parts because, yeah, you know, I'm getting really close to having, uh, Construction Tools 20, only, like, probably, like, another level and a half off from, from that, and, uh, well, I needed, I knew I had some mechanical parts, but I only had, like, 16 of them, so, figure you just discuss that with you guys, and, uh, while you're, uh, you know, while doing this kind of thing, it's like, you know, help fill the video a bit, sometimes it gets a little bit boring. And while I was traveling over here, you you might have seen, you probably seen the machete in my hot bar, you know, just just kind of sitting there. It's uh, I actually stopped at the military base that I spent the first night of the series in for a temporary little base, uh, and I picked up some stuff, uh, including ear horn and this uh, machete. So means I can access uh, corn now and. If I really felt like it, you know, just start living purely off of cornbread, but got plenty of, uh, meat. And I'm, I got some eggs at home, I can just make, uh, bacon and eggs. See you later, Psycho Steve. We got a shotgun short barrel and, uh, some, um, ooh, hello there. Ooh, I don't want to go with that free blue. Oh, see you later. Oh, hello. Looks like a little bit of watering horn. Let's see how Curly likes a crossbow bowl. Oh, yeah, he really likes it. Yep, there you go. I don't know if I'll be increasing the difficulty on this, considering, you know, like... I did uh, crank up the difficulty a little bit too too fast on Challenge Master, so I do. And I'm not saying I don't mind the uh, that I might have that I don't like the uh, health increase on the zombies. No, that's not the problem. It's just that, like you know, especially if you watch uh, like all the Challenge Master episodes all the way through, it's like I'm just kind of like you know, I got. Take it down a couple times by uh, Curly, the the blue Walker zombie there, laying down. And it's like the dogs hit so hard if I encounter those, which I don't like uh, that at all. Damn, some ammo. Some good ammo at that fact. Um, what I actually do is I'll just throw some stuff in the in the in the base over here. This base is still, uh, work in progress, so I'm like... And, uh, I was just kind of thinking, I'm like, what am I gonna do with this place? So I'm like, I like how it's uh, evolving. Ooh! Nice! The, uh, golden rotten cotton plants are ready to harvest up. But let's just see here. I think my mechanical parts are... I will get this uh, organized here pretty soon once I 
and get the roof chopped out and everything like that. But what I was saying is like, yo, know, I think I'm just gonna kind of turn this into uh, one of those bases where just bulk upgrade stuff and let's see, just just try to get all the stuff organized in here and I do want to uh, I, I am absolutely chock-a-block full of this stuff so I did want to just check these zombies over here because like you know one hell like curly had some steel arrows it's like uh, occasionally they can drop good air ammo for stuff and also didn't want to harvest them up for uh, their resources so let's see sham sandwiches made my existence no get away from me sham sandwiches I will plant those uh, mushroom spores extra five dollars very nice Nice little two-shot with this machete. So, just wanted to harvest this stuff up, and... Ooh. I think that I can just repair this real quick. Let me just... Well, I like to do the save on resources. I like to take a... Just, if I have a stack of forged iron like that, I just like to... Uh, I like to... Take it, take it, and drop the stack because sometimes it'll over repair around stuff, and like it'll just uh, eat up more resources, especially if you don't have fixer unlocked. So let's actually uh, harvest this up real quick. I love uh, being able just to pick up the crops like this, and uh, just being able to do this stuff, and it's like. PC version, you know, like Alpha 21 slash 22 version has a lot of good things going for it, but sometimes there's, uh, there's those little features where it's just kind of like, why did you take away, like, the pickup crops feature from, from the, so, like, you know, which console version still has here, which, it's kind of like, why? Just why? Craft up 20 more seeds for cotton... Oh, goldenrod and cotton. Uh, where's the cotton at? Nice 60 cotton, so... We'll just make this into... No, 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 no. We'll just make this into your... Into the old, uh... 20, and there we go. Oh, I actually did not realize that... Don't need to, you don't actually need a don't actually need a workbench. Whoops! <laughs> I did not know. I I legitimately thought for a for a king size bed you need a, you need a uh, a full uh, like you need a work you need to craft that a workbench. To me, that makes a lot of sense. But um, it's getting close to nighttime. And I uh, got some more profit today. We're we're ending it off with uh, fourteen thousand three hundred ninety-four dukes. So I'm really happy with the profit on that. So I'd say it's been a successful episode. You know, getting the mechanical parts I needed for uh, for the workbench and uh, all my construction tools may not be all the way up to uh, scratch. Uh, I like the, uh, I'd say I'm still happy with uh, the progress we made, you know, replanting crops now, so. And, uh, if I'm gonna start making king-sized beds, I'm probably gonna start, I probably should make a, no, a whole new, uh, extend the farm plot out for, for this, just to get this thing going, and, you know, probably also get fertilizer upgraded, you know upgrading on this so we can get even more uh, cloth fragments out of it. But anyways, if you made it to the end of the episode today, I thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you like and subscribe. I will be doing more stuff on Overnight, and I hope you all take care.